What do you call a row of rabbits jumping backwards? A receding hairline. Yo, yo, welcome back. It's your boy Bob. Today we're going over adding a little bit more mechanics to our basic jumping ability here. Right now we can just basically jump up and down at one height. So let's go to our character strip and add a little bit more to it. So the only real thing we're adding here as far as variables go are two public floats. One called Coyote Time that we're going to equal to 0.4 and then a private float Coyote Time Count that's you guessed it going to be our time counter. So then we scroll down to our jump script here and we have if our player's velocity dot y equals zero then our coyote time count is going to equal that point four we made earlier and else then it's just going to count back to zero so this changes things up a bit so now we can only jump if our coyote time is greater than zero so that means for point four seconds when our player isn't directly on the ground we only have point four seconds to jump now so now if we save it and go back kind of take a look at this coyote time we've implemented you see even though we fall off the edge we still have 0.4 seconds to still jump and that also means that once we jump we still have 0.4 seconds to jump again so that's kind of two birds and one stone with that we got a double jump and we got coyote time but let's take it one step further so let's go back to that script now under that script we just added we can add in an if statement for our get button up jump so if we release the key while the player is jumping then we can kind of slash the uh, jump force at which the player jumps so we can kind of control how hard we jump and how high he jumps and if you don't like that double jump feature you would just add in the uh, coyote time count to equal zero on the get button up but I like the double jump feature so I'm gonna leave it in you can kind of do it a different way if you have a better way but if I, we go back to play and save that and go back you can see now that when I hold the jump button he jumps but if I tap the jump button he only jumps a bit but that's about it for this video I just wanted to add in a little bit more functionality to our jumping for our player mechanics and uh, stick around till next time hope you liked it hit me in the comments if you have any questions and until next time guys peace what do you call skydiving when the parachute doesn't work jumping to a conclusion